Hi, my name is Violet and I'm the geek from Glasses Geek and welcome to my channel. And just to make it extra geeky, that's geek spelled with two threes. <laughs> Please ignore any background noise from people, TV, laundry, <laughs> humidifier is working, what have you. This is my intro video, so welcome. Uh, I hope you get to really enjoy yourself. I hope you really like the content that I put out and really what this actually is is it's kind of a vlog. It really actually is just a regular everyday old vlog and I decided I was going to be myself if I was going to make these things and what more way to be myself than actually wear what I would wear and I want to make a video anyway where I was in my bathrobe so here I am. This is what I usually wear. So just to get into my vlog what is this all going to entail? Well, it's going to entail just basically everyday life stuff, stuff that affects me. But some of the topics that I'm going to be covering are, are you know, illness of all kinds, uh, some illnesses that I've been dealing with, terrible physical illness, uh, what I call social illness, uh, such as bullying, uh, abuse. Uh, then there's mental illnesses such as anxiety and depression. Um, I'm going to be basically covering psychology. I'm going to be covering sociology. Uh, I'm going to be covering anything and everything that interests me. My health has been, and I'll give you a little background here. Uh, I am quite ton tongue in cheek with some things. I like slipping little puns and jokes in here, in here and there. So, <laughs> so bear with me. Um, I'm pretty boring and mundane. Currently at this point in time, my life is really an upheaval, but it's been an upheaval for the past 30 years or so. My health has been quite bad and I have had a couple of near-death experiences and they have all been negative. Very, very, very negative. This last one was negative and positive and for the first time ever I actually had a positive near-death experience which which set me on a huge spiritual quest if you want to call it that um, and because it sent me on this huge spiritual quest I have gotten interested in anything and everything I let me see um, so, of course, I've gotten near, interested in near-death experiences. I've read Abraham Hicks and gotten into that, The Secret and Positive Thinking. Um, I'm going to be trying that out. Um, I've gotten into Dolores Cannon and her books. I haven't been able to order any of her books yet, but I hope to. Uh, there's Eric Von Donneken and his stuff. He's, uh, he's the one that proposes that, you know, I, I'm into all things extraterrestrial too. <laughs> And, uh, and I actually, I'm into all things aliens, uh, ancient aliens and stuff. Not so much into the ancient aliens, but it, that, that really does fascinate me. I've never been into history. I've never liked history, but, uh, I am into aliens, extraterrestrials. Uh, I've gotten into magic here recently, Wiccan and witchcraft. Uh, I've gotten into tarot cards. Uh, I'm very much into spiritualism and the afterlife, uh, I've gotten into all thing, all these things recently, and it's because of the near-death experience that I had. Uh, I was raised a uh, an evangelical Christian to the point where my parents, who were very abusive, exercised me, and you know, and I'm currently living in an extremely haunted house. Uh, speaking of that, I am into. LGBTA and Q2 rights, uh, and I'm into women's rights, I'm into Black Lives Matter and workers' rights, the poor's rights campaign, you know, working, you know, for poor people. Um, so I'm, I'm very much into all kinds of humanitarian and for equality type of items. So yeah, I'm in, I'm also into science. Um, I'm not good at math, but I, I am into math, especially when it comes to money. <laughs> you know, uh, I am into technology. Uh, I, I am an artist 
and I love crafts. Crafts are my thing, but I never do them. I always do art and painting. Uh, I've learned feng shui and the bungwa, as they call it. I can't pronounce it correctly, but it's this Chinese thing, and I should really come out with a book with that. And I'm also into interior decoration and design and exterior decoration and design. So obviously I'm going to be talking on that. I've gotten into cooking and gardening with such terrible health here. I've gotten into natural health. I'm into, you know, all these, they call it new age things, you know, like shrooms for curing anxiety and all this, you know, I, I haven't taken it, but you know, I'm into researching it and whatnot. I'm into stones. I'm into magnets and crystals now. Uh, I'm into, you know, since science, I'm into the weather and this planet and the plants and nature, you know, and making sure that this planet is of some state that it can actually sustain human life. <laughs> uh, we are killing off all of the animal and plant life. So if we're killing off that, there's not much hope for us. But I'm into Elon Musk <laughs> because of that. So I don't know. I'm just, I'm just into so many things and in so many areas. I could just go on forever. And this is really rambly compared to my last intro video that I wanted to make. But I am being able to be a lot more calm and be myself. And I haven't got myself all dressed up really. I am fixed up a little bit. I, I got a little bit of jewelry on. I just got lipstick and some uh, eyebrow stuff on. Um, I really struggle with dehydration. I really struggle some days to stay alive. Thankfully, my health is picking up, but uh, I've always struggled with not having energy and not having, having strength. And as I've been getting older, I, I've been really struggling with, uh, well, kidney problems and... Uh, gut problems and whatnot and but well I'll go into that in some other videos more in depth so this is really just a real personal video and um, I'm going to be talking about myself all the things that I wonder about all the things that I want to talk about and I hope you all will be willing to come along with me if I can I do plan to put out or at least I want to put out I definitely want to I want to put out one video a week, but I plan to put out at least one to two videos a month. If I can't do two videos a month, I am definitely going to try to put out one video a month. So that does mean at least 12 videos a year. I'd like to be able to put out 24 videos a year. We'll see if I'll make that. That is my goal. Um, Unfortunately, the laptop that I have, it is starting to flunk out. I'm hoping I can keep it going for as long as possible. I don't have another laptop to record on and to put video out on. Uh, and, and my connection to the internet is dial-up, basically, when it comes to uploading stuff. It's, it's interesting how they'll let you have really fast download speeds, but they won't let you have fast upload speeds. It'd be nice if all these internet providers actually provided an upload speed that was really good, you know? Like, even if you had to sacrifice download speed for it, you know, it's like, just let me have the option of choosing a fast upload speed, please, you know, even if it means cutting my download speed. So, um, I'm also into other YouTubers and whatever I stumble across on the internet and any software, video programs, computers that I enjoy. If if I can, I would like to be able to do product testing. I don't know if I'm ever going to get a chance to do that. Uh, I would like to be able to do product testing of spiritual stuff. I would like to go traveling and do a traveling vlog. But we'll see if my health permits. But most importantly, we'll see if I ever have the money to do that. Currently, I have no sponsors. I don't even have a Patreon page. If I can, I'll get a Patreon page up and going. But the first and foremost thing is getting internet speed that's faster than it is and a new laptop so I can actually <laughs> so I can actually video edit properly. Um, so yeah, uh, I've never had a Patreon page before. I've never had a, you know, rattling the tin cup, please give me money sort of thing before, you know, or a plat pass the plate sort of thing if you're more of a churchgoer. You might understand that better. Um, so 
yeah, I don't know if I'm going to have a Patreon page. That really kind of makes me feel bad, but I need it. I really do, especially if I'm going to be doing this kind of thing. And I want to be doing this on a constant and continuous basis. I want to be making YouTube videos. I've been wanting to make YouTube videos for a long time now. I've been wanting to put out YouTube videos on a twice a week basis for a long time now and just do a regular everyday old sit back and relax vlog like I'm doing now. So I'm glad that I'm able to do this. Uh, so yeah, there's a lot of stuff in my life that I'm not able to come out of the closet about, which is why I'm doing this from my little Walmart put together closet at the moment. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'm, my financial situation is really bad. And I know that there's other people out there whose financial situation is really bad. I know that there's a lot of people who are having to live in their cars, who are having to live in hotels and motels, who are having to live, you know, and they're working, they're working, you know, two, three jobs. And I, I don't know how you can work more than two retail jobs when you're homeless like that, because being homeless is a full-time job in and of itself, just trying to find a place to sleep, just trying to get some food in your mouth, just trying to get a shower is, it's a fight. Just, just having a toilet, you know, just being able to go to the bathroom is a fight and really hard. And that's when you're living out of your car. So I plan on talking about stuff like that. I plan on talking about a lot of things I plan on bringing up. I'm very, one of my names online here was tactless truth. And I am, I'm very, I'm Asperger's. So I'm very tactlessly truthful. And this video is getting a bit long, so I'm going to have to cut it short here. So, uh, I also have to keep these videos down to 15 to 20 minutes because it takes two hours just to upload a 10 to 15 minute video. And that's if I sat, sit there and watch it all day long. So or at least it feels all day long. It's, it's really, it really takes more like four hours to upload a 15 minute video. So, uh, I plan on talking about a whole lot of stuff. I'm going to be very tactless and truthful about it. I don't mean to be, but I can't help but be honest. My Asperger's brain just won't let me do anything but state what I find to be the truth or I find to be honest. And I'm not going to be insulting any of these spiritual items, but I will be, I do have days where I'm physically ill and I can't help but be cranky and I will be bringing up a lot of really good points that I've been meaning and wanting to mention. And believe it or not, when it comes to the secret in Abraham Hicks and positive thinking, it does have its place. It does help. But as for other items, maybe not so much. You know, so anyway, uh, yeah, so I'm going to be getting into all these things. I've already gotten into them, but I'll be getting into them deeper automatically. And I figure why not just record it and why not just let you guys know my findings as I search out all of these things, all of these spiritual things, all of these extraterrestrial things, which is what I'm mainly interested in now. Uh, all of these afterlife things, which is what I'm mainly interested in now. Um, and mention any and all links, you know, such as Holy Kool-Aid. They did a really good near-death experience uh, video that I especially agree with the end of it. I don't know if I agree with the middle and beginning, but I definitely agree with the end um, currently. But yeah, so... Since I got to cut this video short, uh, let me look at my notes real fast here. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. Uh, I have so much to talk about. If you want to help out at all, you can contribute. I'm going to try to put up a Patreon page or some type of like a PayPal sort of link. I'm not good with computers, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, so if the links don't work or giving to me isn't working, just let me know. And I'll, I'll try to figure something out. Uh, and I hope to come up with, you know, I already have a lot of questions and I already have a whole lot of info and a whole lot of answers, even if there are temporary answers. And as with all things, you know, this is my opinion and this is my life path and this is my life. So 
my answers that I find may not work for you and take everything that I say with a grain of salt and opinions are like farts. Everyone has them <laughs> and they all stink, but sometimes you can find a fart that is so similar to yours, you almost enjoy it. <laughs> or in other words, you can find an opinion that's so similar to yours that you actually enjoy it. So there is a way to look at that opinion thing and taking everything with a grain of salt because, you know, that's the way it is. But yeah, this is my life and I'm going to be vlogging it. And please come along for the ride. So thank you. And thank you for letting me be myself and be who and what I am. Even in this extreme fundamentalist Christian, fundamentalist Muslim, Jewish, whatever world we live in, where you can't make mistakes, there's only one way, and anyone who's an outsider like me just from birth is not welcomed. Maybe together, through this channel, and through being together, there was a squeaky car out there, maybe through this channel and being together, we can create a hideaway, a getaway, where all of us can be accepted for who and what we are. Thank you, and I love you. Herming birds unite! And Nanu Nanu, <laughs> or Nanu Nanu, live long and prosper. And as Mr. Rogers said, it's you I like. It's every part of you. Your skin, your eyes, your soul. I know I augmented it a bit, but there you go. <laughs> Glasses geeks unite! Woo! <laughs> Bye.